You are shaking. I, I know. <laughs> I feel your nervousness from here. Are you okay? Yes. Yeah, no, I am. Mr. Benny, you are not the father. You said earlier that if Robin was not your biological child, it causes you to doubt whether or not you truly are the biological father of Jermaine Benning Jr. The court wants to make sure when you leave here, you have the whole truth. You are not the father. Um, <clears throat> it's painful. Like if you ask me, it's, it's painful. You've seen that video, right? Two kids. No one belonged to the man. You see the man crying. And he, sometimes I ask myself, man, like actually what did they go on with this, our, our present society? Infidelity in marriages. Like right now, we, everybody live here. Because at the end of the day, like situation that happened last month, I saw a man that trained up four children. Something happened that they had to go do DNA test and every, every other thing. Now the later found out that the man was not the biological father of the four kids. Four kids that he has trained through school, loved from a tender age. He has done literally everything. The bond and everything has been there from day one. There is a saying that only mothers knows the true father of the children. Now this got me thinking, you understand? For those that was given birth to in the 60s, 70s and 80s, coming down to 90s. You know, this whole DNA thing was not rampant as of that time. Now I me, mean, I'm asking myself, if actually we've been asked right now to go for a DNA test, how many of you can beat your hand on your chest and say your father is actually your biological father? But this is the question I keep asking myself. What is this generation turning into? Oh man, it's painful. Having a bond with kids and at the end of the day, you go for a test and you find out that you're not actually the father. And at the end of the day, you see, we, you know, the society and everything favors the women. Now think about it. After all the stress, all the pain a man goes through to raise a family, at the end of the day, you find out that you're raising another man. Another man's children. Like I said earlier, I want to ask. If we that were born in the 60, 70, 80, and 90 go for DNA test, how many of us will find out that our father is actually our biological father? Leave your comment in the comment section. Talk to me. I will respond. Thank you.